Good morning everyone, happy Wednesday. It's me again at 7 a.m. And um, yeah, today we have our optional conditioning class. So this is, um, like I said on my stories just a little bit, uh, a little while ago, today is an optional session. So please don't feel that you have to join in, but if you would like to, the session is here and we're gonna be doing a little cardio circuit it's going to take us about the actual circuit's about 15 minutes which is nice and short and um, we're going to obviously add on a full warm-up at the start just to make sure that we're nice and ready to train um but that is it it's going to be a quick short sharp session and you are going to be done and able to get on with the rest of your day so i'm just going to wait for a few more moments for everyone to join i've also gone completely bare faced today because i just know that i'm going to drip with sweat through this so i just decided i was like i can't be bothered to put anything on my face so I'll just leave it. Um, ooh, very random people sending me messages. Not quite sure what that is. Um, good, so I'm just gonna wait a few more moments for a few more of you to join and then we will get started with our warm up. So hopefully everyone fe is feeling good. It's also supposed to absolutely tip it down with rain today. So it's probably good to get your workout in first thing in the morning, get it done and then you can just sit inside and look out miserably at the rain. <laughs> right, I am gonna turn off these comments just so that you guys can see what I'm doing, although it's so nice to hear from you as always. Um, and then when you're ready, if we all come to our mat, we're gonna start on our hands and knees. We're just gonna start with a nice, slow, easy warm up and then sort of build momentum through the session. So we're gonna start hands and knees, hands under the shoulders, knees under the hips, and we're just gonna start by mobilizing through the spine. So you, I, I want you to just start by thinking about tucking the pelvis under, rounding up through your spine, pressing the floor away, chin to chest, and then arching through the back, just reversing that position all the way up to the ceiling. Good. Chin to chest, rounding through the spine, pressing the floor away, feeling the space between the shoulder blades, and then arching through the back, taking that chin all the way up to the ceiling. Last time now, rounding through the spine. Good, nice work. And then arching through the back, Chin up towards the ceiling. From here, finding that neutral spine again. Right hand comes in between both shoulders, left hand to the side of the head. We're gonna reach that left elbow up towards the ceiling. So rotating through that thoracic spine and then reaching that left elbow down towards the opposite wrist. Again, reaching that left elbow up and over. Reaching down towards the opposite wrist. One more time, just seeing there's a massive spider on the ceiling, which is not what you want to see at the start of a workout. Reaching down and changing sides. Left hand now coming in between both shoulders, right hand at the side of the head. Again, reaching that right elbow up and open, reaching down towards that opposite wrist. This is two. Good, nice work. Last one, three. Good, nice. From here, coming up into your, um, sorry, tucking your toes, coming up into your downward dog position. So tuck the toes, find your way to your downward dog, just sitting those hips back and just taking a moment here just to ease your body into this position. So just gently pushing the chest towards the kneecaps. You can have a soft bend in the knees here and then just stepping out from each for a, bringing the weight into one heel and then into the other, just easing out through the backs of the legs. Really, really nice. Just taking your time here. Starting to build the heat of the body, starting to build a little bit of breath as well, so just getting yourself a little bit more warmed up. From here, we're going to scoop the hips up and over, dropping the hips down towards the floor, opening up through the chest, we sit the hips back onto the heels, and then send those hips I find our way back to our downward dog. And do that again, so scooping the hips up and over, dropping them through, reaching those hips through, chest up towards the ceiling, sitting the hips back, and then finding that downward dog. One more time here, gross, that's something attached to my foot, scooping up and over, dropping the hips through, just opening up through the front of the hip flexors there, sitting the hips back, and then finding that downward dog. Good, from here, scooping up and over, left foot comes forwards, reaching the left hand up and over, we rotate towards that leg, and then reach that elbow down towards the floor, changing sides, so we're building a little bit of momentum now, reaching the right arm up, Folding that arm in half, right elbow reaches down towards the floor. Same again on the left, left leg forwards. Reaching that left arm up towards the ceiling, folding that arm in half, reaching that down towards the floor. And then same on the right, reaching that right arm up, folding that arm, reaching that elbow down towards the floor. Good, from here, bring that left leg forwards again. This time we're now gonna rock back into that hamstring. So we rock back, just leaning over that front leg, we're gonna feel a nice stretch at the back of that hamstring. Rocking forward, send it back. So the hand comes in, sorry, the foot comes in between the hands. So it's that nice long lunge. We rock back into that heel, rock forwards, send that leg back. Again, hand, so I keep saying hand, foot in between the hands, rocking forwards, rocking back, 
and changing sides. Last hand on the right foot in between both hands, rocking back, rocking forward, sending that leg back. From here, soften the knees, walking the hands towards the feet. Good, just building a little bit more um, heat for the body, just getting ourselves nice and warm. We're going to come down into the bottom of our squat. So we need to find the bottom of that squat, your comfortable squat position. Elbows are going to come inside those knees, dropping those hips down towards the floor, opening up through the groin. And then hands come to toes. We're just going to fold ourselves over those hips here. So folding ourselves over, not our hips, our legs even. So coming into a nice forward fold, pulling that stretch on the back of the hamstrings. And then what we're going to do is sit the hips back down from there, elbows inside of the knees. Good. And again, hands to toes, folding ourselves up and over. Breathing through, and then sitting the hips down, elbows inside of those knees. Good, we're going to do that one more time. Piking the hips up, folding ourselves over, and then bringing those hips back down, elbows inside of knees, coming up to standing. Last little bit, I want you to think about touching the floor, so we're just going to reach down, touch the floor, and then reach up, come onto your, to uh, onto your toes. Expertly demonstrated, just like that, falling over. <laughs> so the, the goal is, we're going to reach down, reach up. Reach down, reach up. We're going to do that 10 times. We're going in three, two, and one. So touching the floor, reaching up. Touching the floor, coming onto our tiptoes at the top. That's two, three, and four. Reaching up. Five, and six. Good, keep going. Seven, eight, nine. Squeezing the glutes as you reach up. Ten, good. So, hopefully your heart rate's nice and raised now. We're getting ready to move into our main session. So, today we have five rounds of five exercises. So, it's a circuit-based kind of cardio thing. I'm just going to open this door. Already hot. Woo! So, five exercises, five rounds, same as last week. So, if you joined me last week, you're going to know what we're doing. If you didn't, let me just talk through the exercises really quickly. So we're working for 20 seconds on each exercise, and then we take a 10 second rest in between each exercise. So 20 seconds of work, 10 seconds rest, and then we do all of those exercises in, in that format, and we do that five times. So hopefully that makes sense. You seem to be talking in a very haphazard way this morning. Sometimes my work sentences string together perfectly well in the morning, and sometimes at this time my brain just doesn't function like it should do, and I end up talking rubbish, and I get to the end of the live and think, what the hell did I just say? Anyway, today's one of those days, so just bear with me. <laughs> so, we're going to be starting with our skaters. So that is basically jumping to one side, loading up that leg, the other leg stays off the floor, we reach up in opposition, and then load ourselves side to side, so we're moving laterally. And I said this last week, but really making sure that one leg is only on the floor at the same at one time. So as you jump to the side, that one leg is working, the other leg reaches back, and then we're just launching ourselves side to side. Okay, that's exercise one. Exercise two, we come down to the floor. Don't worry if you can't remember these because I'm obviously going to do it with you. We come down to the floor, we find our plank position. From here, we're just going to tap either shoulder and we're going to go for some shoulder taps. So anti-rotation exercise, we've talked about this a lot. The whole purpose is to avoid the torso rotating from side to side, the trunk rotating from side to side. So we're really aiming there to try and keep our trunk nice and stable so our our body nice and stable, and it's just the arms that are doing the movement, tapping over the shoulder. From there, we come up to standing. We have a squat to squat jump. So that is essentially one body weight squat into one squat jump. Really nice and simple. That was an easy one. From there, we move into our shoot throughs. We had this in yesterday's workout, so hopefully you're all going to know what you're doing here. But we basically find our tabletop position. We lift those knees off the floor, and then we shoot one leg through, reaching the opposite hand off. So my right leg shoots through, my left hand lifts off. I then come through that tabletop position, left leg lifts off, right hand lifts off. So it's essentially just rocking side to side, moving through that tabletop position, reaching that leg through. And then from there, I had, uh, I had burpees in there, and I was like, should I keep them, should I not? Because I'm not like a massive fan of burpees. But I think for this purpose, but we're just doing a little bit of raising our heart rate, I think they're fine. So we are going to go for burpees to finish. We touch the chest to the floor, bringing those feet in, and go for that little jump at the top. So those are our five exercises, really nice and simple, and all you're going to do is do that five times round. So we just get 10 seconds rest in between each exercise, so it is going to feel as though you're struggling and maybe a little bit for breath at times, raising that heart rate, getting ourselves nice and physically fit, hopefully. 
Because I feel sometimes when I do this, I'm like, God, I'm so unfit. <laughs> so don't worry, I'm with you. We'll get there. We'll improve. So we are. I'm going to put some music on. Hopefully this is going to um, be okay. It's, um, I'm trying to find the perfect license-free music playlist, and I'm yet to find it. So all of my music thus far on license-free is like really rubbish, so I'm sorry. But hopefully this is okay. Good, so getting yourself ready. We're starting with those skaters. So we're launching ourselves side to side, lateral bounds. Make sure that you're reaching that hand across, just using that to load up that hip. And we are going, here's our workout, in three, in two, and one. Let's do this, guys. So starting five rounds, and then you are done. So just 20 seconds on each exercise. Starting with these lateral bounds. Good, nice. Final five, four, three, two, and one. Take a second, so we get that 10 second rest. That's where we transition to the next exercise. And we are going in three, two, and one. Shoulder taps. Tapping either shoulder. Good. Keeping that torso really stable. Nice, guys. Finishing in three, two, and one. Up to standing. Squat to squat jump. One squat, one squat jump. Going in five, four, three, two, and one. Here we go. One squat. One squat jump. Nice. Good work, guys. Nice and slow and controlled on the squat. And then explosive in your squat jump. Three, two, and one. Down to the floor, shoot throughs. So finding your way to that tabletop position, shooting that leg through, we are going in three, two, and one. Here we go. Shooting that leg through. Nice. Reaching opposite arm and leg off. Finishing in five, and three, two, and one. Here we go, coming up to standing. To finish this round, we have those burpees. We are going in five, and three, two, and one. Here we go, chest to floor, jumping those legs through, little jump. Good, nice. Keep the pace. Three, two, and one. Good, take a second. One round down, four to go. Woo! So we are going in four. Skaters, back to our skaters, and off we go. Sorry, I had a bit of a brain moment there. What are we doing? Skaters side to side. Good, final ten. Stay with me. Three, two, and one. Nice work. Down to the floor. Shoulder taps. Finding your way to your plank position. We are going in three, two, and one. Here we go. Pelvis in line. Make sure you're not rotating side to side. Good. Nice work. Slow and controlled here. Three, two, and one. Good. Squat to squat jump. Coming up to standing. One squat, one squat jump. We're going in three, two, and one. Here we go. One squat, one squat jump. Use those arms to power you. Good. Nice work, guys. Terrible music. Three, two, and one. Good. Can you see what I mean about this music? I'm so sorry. Finding your way to your tabletop position. Shoot through. We are going in three, two, and one. Here we go. Shooting that leg through. Good. Nice. Just moving through that tabletop position. Final five seconds coming up. Finishing in three, two, 
and one. Up to standing, burpees to finish, round two. We are going in five, and three, two, and one. Here we go, chest and block. Woo! Doing really well, guys. Two down, three to go. Three, two, and one. Good. Grab some water if you need it. Ten seconds. We're going back into those skaters. Cool. Five, four, three, two, and one. Let's do this. Skaters side to side. Come on. Round three of four is happening. Coming up to that halfway point. Don't lose it now. Finishing in three, two, and one. Take ourselves down to the floor. Shoulder taps. Finding that plank position. We are going in three, two, and one. Here we go. Squeeze that core. Nice straight line with the body. Just tapping either shoulder. Good work. Slow and control here. Three, two, and one. Stepping those legs in. Deep breaths. Squat to squat down. We are going in five. And three, two, and one. Here we go. One squat. One squat jump. Nice work. Using those arms to power you. Good. Three, two, and one. Down to the floor. Find that tabletop position. Shoot throughs. Almost there now. Over halfway. We're going in three, two, and one. Here we go. Lifting those knees off. Shooting that leg through. Good. Nice work. Finishing in five. And three, two, and one. Up we get. Last exercise of this round, then we're two rounds to go. We are over halfway, doing really well. Final five seconds of this rest. We go in three, two, and one. Here we go. Chest to floor. Jumping those legs through. Just two rounds to go after this. Nice work, guys. Three, two, and one. Three rounds down, two to go. Grab some water if you need. Back into those skaters. In five, and three, two, and one. Let's go, round four or five. We're so close now. We're coming up to that final round. Keep working, keep pushing. You should be at eight out of 10 at least right now. Finishing in three, two, and one. Down to the floor, shoulder taps. Finding that plank position. Woo. Going in five, and three, two, and one. Here we go, tapping over shoulder. Nice work, guys. Slow and controlled as you tap over shoulder. Keep that body nice and straight. Three, two, and one. Stepping up, squat to squat jump. Oh, I am dripping. Come on, guys. Final five seconds. This rest, we go in three, two, and one. Let's do this. Squat and squat jump. One squat, one squat jump. Nice work. Using those arms to power you. Three, two, and one. Down to the floor. Top, uh, tabletop position. Ready for those shoot throughs. We are going in three, in two, and one. Let's do this. Lifting those knees off, shooting that leg through. Good. Halfway, 10 seconds to go. Final three, two, and one. Up we get. Burpees to finish, and then we are into our final round. Going in five, and three, two, and 
and one. Here we go. Bring that chest to the floor. We're so almost there now, team. Good, nice work. tomorrow morning again 7am for our lower body session I'm sorry, but, <laughs> and, um, and I look forward to seeing as many of you, of you as possible then so have a wonderful rest of your Wednesday have a great day and I will speak to you tomorrow bye <laughs>